For the past 16 years, I've been a member of the Norwegian Parliament. And during these years, I've taken part in endless conversations about uh, polarization, the lack of trust across class and gender, the collapse of public conversation. But as time went by, I felt this growing need to explore how these huge society shaping tendencies play out between people and within people. How do they affect our daily lives and our close relations? And so I started to write about Tonya, a clever meteorology student, bright, hardworking, eager to go places. But also a girl who grew up with a single mom, unable to be the grown up that Tonya needed. So Tonya carries within her this fragility. She's uh, hungry for attention, affirmation, and this neediness is particularly prominent in her various relationships with men. Then she meets Jürgen, a perfect guy, raised on healthy liberal values in a warm, generous family. Tonya should embrace happiness, but is she able to settle and share the values, the perceptions and ways of these new people in her life? Significant Man Syndrome is a novel about social disobedience and deep unrest.